businesses and industries were once again counting losses after parts of the country were plunged into darkness following a power blackout. The power outage paralyzed services in most major towns, including Mombasa, Eldred and Kisumu. Sources say flight operations from major airports were disrupted, occasioning delays and even cancellations. Kenya Power says the cause of the outage which occurred from 6 p.m. could not be immediately established. Kenyans took to social media to vent their anger over the power outage, which plunged most homes into darkness and disrupted evening activities. The outage was also reported in neighboring country Uganda, where electricity distributor Umeme Limited is working to restore power supply. The hitch comes barely a day after the Ministry of Energy tried to calm down power consumers following an uproar over abnormal electricity charges. Kenya Power now assuring customers it will make amends. We are requesting them to come on board so that uh, we carry out a correction exercise on, on their bills. And for those who we have... Um, you know, overestimated, we will provide uh, credits, and those who have, under, who have been underestimated, we will then allow them some, uh, you know, period to pay for the bills that would be uh, out, outstanding. Kenya Power has been at pains to explain its decision to back debt bills to enable it to recoup costs amounting to 8 billion shillings incurred last year. The company says it will now issue bills based on actual meter readings, as opposed to estimates. The power distributor is set to release an app that will enable customers upload meter readings by themselves. So one the situation where we do not have to come and disturb your comfort in your house to say open for us the gate, we want to read our meter. Meanwhile, Ambassador Mahbub Malim Mohammed is the new Kenya Power Chair. Mohammed replaces Kenneth Marende, who had served since December 2014. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV.